Hey everybody! Well today I thought we'd take a look at this pretty cool looking sculpture. It's like a resin art sculpture. I found this on Etsy and there's quite a few different versions of these and it uh, feels pretty heavy. So it comes from a company called Resin Art YPC. It comes in this really nice package. They sent also along with this a very nice uh, canvas bag here. It's got this little scenery. Looks like the planets and ocean life on both sides here and then you can see the resin art logo right there and then they also sent this little uh, envelope and in here is a little card and I think these are instructions to make sure that the lights work properly so that in case you have any problems it tells you how to fix it and then also tells you about the way they manufacture these things you can see the lathe and the, the care that they put into creating these pieces. So this should be a pretty nice thing. Now let me figure out how to open this bubble wrap and we'll get inside of it. Okay, so it looks like this just has a lid on it. So we can take this piece out of here. This is a nice little way that they've uh, managed to wrap it. All right, so let's take a look here. Now, as I mentioned, they have different versions of these. I ordered two different ones, and I'll review the other one here when I when I get it. But this one here appealed to me. Oh wow! Ooh, okay, this is really cool looking. All right, so it's got some heft to it because it's got this resin in here. But look at this! Oh wow, that is beautiful. That is absolutely beautiful. That is fantastic. Okay, we'll have to get some close-ups of this, but you can see there's an astronaut down here floating in what looks like space or maybe on an asteroid, the way they got the whole thing looking. You got a really nice cool shuttle. That is awesome, and they got this nice wood in here too. Wow, this is incredible. All right, well, let's go ahead and see what the rest of this has. Also inside the package, it came with a USB power connector as well. I just noticed it. All right, so let's get some close-ups of this thing real quick. Now, the uh, resin in here is very nice. You can see there's a little bit of air bubbles going on in there, but they said that is normal. Actually, it looks like glitter. That is glitter they put in there. Oh, sorry for the reflection. See the glitter that's down in there? It's very cool. There is the shuttle it looks like it's a, a little model a little plastic model in there and then we have the astronaut floating around out there that looks really neat i have always been fascinated with stuff that is encased in resin even when i was a kid i remember i had this paperweight that had all these pennies in it uh, look at this wood the wood is blended in right with the uh the resin and you can see that really nice painted detail that they added in there kind of makes it look like it's an asteroid or something. Here on the bottom, we have even more of that detail going on. Now, if you look, there's a little hole down there. I think there's a light that comes up through there, and I'll show you the light here in just a minute. I love the way the resin just is, you know, uh, like intermixed with the wood. That looks very, very cool. Here's the other side. I like that little small section right there. The wood looks very good. There is the plug-in for the electronics. And here we can see the back side. It's really neat how they did this. They must have a mold, I guess, and just pour it in there. I don't know. I don't know how they make these. Like I said, I've always been fascinated. I remember when we were kids, uh, we had a family friend that was into this stuff. And he made a table that was made out of this. And I always remember the smell of the resin <laughs> when we went over to his house. Wow, this is beautiful. All right, let's plug it in and check out the lights. All right, so the power cable has a little button on it to turn it on and off. And then you're gonna have to provide your own power block. And then on the back here, we just plug in the, uh, the jack like so. All right, and then let me plug it in. All right, now let me turn the lights down because I think we're gonna have to have the lights completely off to appreciate the lighting on this. Let's turn this completely down. 
and then turn this on. Ooh, there it is right there. Look at that. Ah, oh, that looks cool. Okay, actually, you know what? I think we need to turn off the main room lights here. Let's turn those off, too. Oh, okay, yeah, that's, that's what I'm talking about right there. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Look at that. That is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Wow, I'll get some close-ups of it because you can see the glitter really close up. Oh, man, I love this. That is really cool. Very, very cool. Wow. Okay, let me get some close-ups of this. Okay, so now let's take a closer look at this now that it's in the dark. Hopefully the camera won't have too much trouble focusing on this. Now, we can see the shuttle in there. That glitter is really cool. That really adds to the effect. And I love the way the light bounces off the sides of the asteroid. There's the astronaut. Now what's really cool is if you sit, if you kind of go back a little bit, notice how the light kind of beams up from inside there. So it looks like there's just light coming out of that hole, which it basically is. There's a, I'm guessing there's an LED down in there. You can see it if you look from the top. But yeah, that's really cool. I love it. It almost looks like they both got shot out of that hole or something. And the debris is coming out of there with it. There you can see how all of that looks. It kind of um, it kind of looks eerie, doesn't it? <laughs> it has kind of an eerie look to it. Here's the side view. I love this thing. You know, it's not it's more of an ambient light. It's not a light that's going to light up the room by any stretch. Uh, it's simply an art piece. And that's exactly what this is. It's an art piece. Here's the other side of it. Of course, the back, uh, you know, doesn't have too much detail as far as the uh, shuttle goes. Most people are not going to be displaying it that way. You're, of course, going to have it from the front here. But, oh, wow, this is just, this is beautiful. I, and it, it looks brighter on video right now. I mean, it's kind of uh, overexposed on video. If you see it in person, it's got kind of a very, uh, I don't know, the light is much more subdued. It's, of course, brighter down here where it's coming out of the hole, but uh, I, I wish the camera wasn't overcompensating for the light because it, it has a much better look in person. It has a little bit of a purplish haze down here as well. It doesn't show up on camera. Well, maybe a little bit right there. But this is beautiful. I love this thing. So uh, I found this on Etsy from, oh, let's see, what was it? Uh, resin, was it Resin YPC? Uh, what did I say from the beginning? Let me figure that out. Okay, it was Resin Art YPC. I had to look at it again. But um, yeah, they, have, they make several different uh, sculptures and stuff like that. As I mentioned, I have another one coming. Uh, I don't think it was from the same company, though, but I have a feeling that they're probably all made at the same place because they all have kind of the same look and feel to them. And the other one I have coming is an underwater one, which this definitely would work as an underwater piece as well. But it's nice that it can work in space or in the ocean. You know, it's like this resin kind of just gives that kind of a feel. But this is beautiful. So I paid $148 for this. And um, these are handmade. They're uh, handmade pieces. Now, uh, they had free shipping, but I went ahead and paid the extra $10 because um, my experience with free shipping, as enticing as it might be, is that it's going to sit in the mail system for about two weeks. And I, I would rather pay for the shipping because the less time it spends floating around in the mail system, the better as far as I'm concerned especially a piece like this where it could possibly get damaged. But they had it packaged very nicely, as you could see. So this is beautiful. So if you want one of these, head on over to, to Etsy. Um, if you want to look at some of the other pieces from other companies as well, you can check. I, I plugged in um, Resin Art Sculpture, I think is what I did. And you'll see a whole bunch of these different things pop up. I just think these are beautiful. They're absolutely beautiful. All right, well, anyway, <laughs> that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you want one of these, head on over to Etsy. Uh, I'm not getting paid for this, by the way. This is not a paid promotion. I bought this with my own money, and it was just something that I found interesting. All right, well, thank you very much for watching. I always appreciate your viewership, and don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. And until the next video, I'll see you on the next one. So thank you again, and have a good one.